Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I have created this very easy mask friendly makeup look which you can wear every day. Now, let's get started with the tutorial. I'm starting with the Pond's Light Moisturizer today and nicely massaging it in my skin. Ryan, let's <laughs> And then I'm using the Milani Conceal Plus Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation. The key is to use a very thin layer of foundation so that even if we sweat under the mask, the product won't crease as much. Here I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer mainly to highlight the high points of my face and to cover any dark spots. Then I'm using my Johnson's Baby Powder on the areas where I concealed and on the areas where I tend to get oily. This is a very important step to keep everything in place when you wear a mask. Then from the Wet n Wild palette, I'm using the warm brown shade on a fluffy blending brush as the transition color on my eyes and then concentrating the dark brown shade on the outer corner of my eyes with small tapered blending brush. Now I'm using the Maybelline Colossal Kajal on the lower and upper lids of my eyes. You don't need to worry too much about the shape as we are anyway going to blend it with a tapered brush or you can also use a cuter for the step. Now I'm using a tapered blending brush to nicely blend off the kajal above and under my eyelids to give it a nice smoky and blended look. And then using the cream color from the same Wet n Wild palette only in the inner third of the eyes to give it a softer look and then i'm using the golden shade from the same palette in the inner corner of my eyes and under my brow bone now using the dark brown shade to fill in my brows from the same wet n wild palette for my highlighter i'm using the golden shade from the same wet n wild palette today Then I'm using the dark brown shade from the same Wet n Wild palette as my contour today. This is a great way of using one palette for multiple purposes and this also saves a lot of time. For my mascara, I'm using the Maybelline Hyper Curl Waterproof Mascara today. Then I'm quickly lining my lips with a nude lip liner and topping it with the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in the shade Founder. This is a smudge proof long lasting liquid lipstick which you can totally trust on. Then I'm using the same lipstick as my blush today. And then finishing up the look with my trusty Swiss Beauty Makeup Fixer. And finally it's time for the mask test. 
As you can see, the mask is totally clean. The makeup did not transfer at all. Hope you guys found the video helpful. Please do like and subscribe to my channel. See you in my next video.